I'm standing here with defending world champion 1500 meter runner Jenny Simpson. How are you doing, Jenny? Excellent. I'm finally like fancied up for once. <laughs> right, right. Hey, you you clean up nice. Thank you look you, you look I beautiful. It. <laughs> now, being here surrounded by all these awesome athletes, it's like this place becomes the center of the endurance world for for a couple hours here tonight. What's what's your feeling being around rubbing shoulders with Iron Man and you're sort of uh, you're the middle distance. So how do you, how are you feeling? Oh, I feel like it's such a great it's such a great opportunity. I train at the training center, so I have a good opportunity to be around triathletes and I kind of get to observe their world a little bit. But there's nothing like being able to come to an event where you're honoring everyone and you kind of reconnect with the other sports that share some of the adversity you go through and some of the triumphs you experience together. Walk us through last year World Championship final. I mean, going into that thing, we had we had my teammate Morgan Eusney who'd yeah. been tearing it up, and you're in the race, and we're all watching, and you just phenomenal race. Yeah, take us thank take, you. take us through that the final 600 meters or so. You know, I think a lot of it had to do with me just focusing on me, not worrying about the competition around me, um, and and also there's always an element of luck. You know, I was able to really maneuver myself well. Anyone in this sport knows that when it's your day, you got to seize it because uh, there, there's, there's lots of days where you're prepared really well, and then there's days where you're prepared really well and everything falls into place. So I really just feel like it was one of those days for me. The stars totally aligned out absolutely, there on the oval for you. Absolutely. Now, this being the Olympic year, what are, what are your goals for London? You know, my, my goal first is to make the team. Like right. you said, you know, Morgan Eusini, Shannon Robury, Kristen Ward Thomas. I mean, we're talking about some incredible middle distance runners here in the United States. And so it's going to be a huge feat for me to just make the team. Then after that, once again, you know, I want to have a lot of peace about my fitness, going to the Olympic Games, uh, and just focus on me and what I'm able to do. Going into the trials, I would say on, on the ladies' side, the 1500 team is probably is probably the toughest event to make. I mean, you. All the girls you mentioned, Anna, Anna Pierce, she she regains Absolutely. her form. I mean, it's it's totally stacked. So going going into the trials, are you looking to kind of are you trying to peak for the trials, or do you try and peak kind of a, a semi peak to be able to get on the team? I think I have to be my absolute best to make the Olympic team in the United States, and so I will be at my very best fitness on that day and try and carry that through if I make the team to the Olympics. Awesome, yeah. Jenny, it's great to have you here. Thanks. So Congratulations much. Really on all your success. Thanks.